Morning, Steve Reed in Chicago with the morning grain comments. So I hope everybody had a safe and uh, very happy weekend. Uh, calls overnight, uh, there was no overnight trade, so the calls are lower. I think uh, beans could be five to 10 cents lower and corn and wheat three to five cents lower. I think that this time of year, we always look ahead at the next two to three weeks for corn pollination weather, and it looks to be rather benign. It looks to, to be normal rains and, and normal temps for the most part. We could see a little spike in, in temps before fronts move across and then cooler behind it. But overall, where the crops are, are rated the highest, it should be favorable for conditions. Uh, up in the northern areas, we could see hopefully a little drier weather uh, in between the rain showers to allow uh, for those crops to catch up to the rest of the Midwest. Uh, we also should see a little bit better harvest weather for the wheat market. Um, on Friday, the USDA will come out with the new supply and demand numbers. They'll try to incorporate the acreage numbers that we had and try to figure out what the stocks mean as far as old crop uh, feed usage and residual use. Uh, most of the market feels that for the U.S. old crop, they'll keep the bean carryout unchanged. Uh, they could raise the new crop carryout to a bigger number which could be negative to November beans. Uh, in corn, they could leave uh, the old crop carry out about unchanged, maybe a little bit higher due to maybe lower feed usage, but the ethanol demand may be also bigger than what they're saying. In new crop, it's all up to the yield. Do they change that yield because of the high crop ratings and kind of offset a uh, little bit of the um, potential for maybe higher domestic demand? And uh, do they keep the carry out at that billion seven or do they actually raise it because of a higher yield. Globally, they should still show uh, world stocks to be very high uh, in anticipation for 14 and 15, which should be bearish prices. So we don't have a weather problem as of right now. We've got the USDA numbers on Friday. We've got the funds long corn. Actually, they're probably short a few beans right now and short almost a record amount of wheat. So uh, the market's been cleansed over the last couple of months uh, from out of these long positions, and we'll have to see uh, if they want to go short uh, into this growing season. In general, prices should uh, work a little bit lower because of the favorable U.S. weather. As always, uh, these are my thoughts, not those of ADM or ADM Investor Services. And have a safe and profitable trading day.